exactly one year ago i decided to try making money with dropshipping but it didn't really work out how i want i lost money every single month until my last video where i made one thousand dollars in a single month this time i made over one thousand dollars in one week and this is exactly how i did it So about four months ago, I started working with a dropshipping mentor called Michael Bernstein and his student Jacob. And since I know how to make videos, Michael suggested I promote my products with TikTok Organic, where I make videos with the product and try to go viral, which is something his student Jacob is really good at. So I did that and I actually managed to go viral so many times. But with the views I was getting, I should have made a lot more money than I did. So we decided I had to find better products. So I had a Zoom call with Michael and Jacob and I showed them some of the products I found by just scrolling on TikTok and Jacob picked this Jacob picked this ultrasonic cleaning device thing and it's supposed to clean people's glasses and jewelry and those things. Honestly, I was actually confused when he picked it cause like, doesn't it take like two seconds just to clean your glasses like, but I still agreed to test it cause but I still agreed to test it because if you've watched some of my old videos, you would know my biggest weakness is picking good products. So I decided to just go with someone else's judgment because like, what do I know? So I ordered it from Amazon and it arrived four days later. That day, I planned about 10 TikTok videos for the product. And for most of the videos, I just searched for other people selling the same product and copied their viral videos. And I also tried to think of my own funny scenarios. The next day, I filmed and edited the 10 ideas and I started posting two TikToks a day. And by the time, I posted the last video none of them really went viral but I managed to reach 1,000 followers which is what you need if you want to put your website link in the profile but even though I reached 1,000 followers I was honestly starting to doubt whether this product would work because I was looking through the comments and some of them were confirming what I was thinking in the beginning like just use water just use this show you don't actually need this and all of that and it was honestly getting to my head a little bit but I decided to just plan and film another 10 videos but this time some of the ideas were just me replacing Applying to the negative comments and just to add a little bit of controversy in one of the videos I said the device takes three months to clean your glasses instead of three minutes and that was all it took for the video to get almost 200,000 views but I didn't get any sales from that over the next few days I got another semi viral video but again zero sales usually at this point I start to consider moving on to a different product but I actually wanted to test out a theory I had so if you remember, I said I didn't go viral, but I still managed to reach 1,000 followers in just five days. Normally, if you don't go viral, you don't get 1,000 followers that fast. But what I did was I asked for followers at the end of most of the videos by saying I was doing a giveaway. And there's this Discord group that I'm in called The Collective. It's run by these three guys called Cal, Jimmy Farley, and Luca Wujuwuju. And one thing they always tell us is we should never make those giveaway kind of videos. Because if you do that, most of the time, it's going to show your video to kids. Because kids are the only ones dumb enough to believe you and follow you. So you end up reaching the 1,000 followers. But almost all of them will be kids. Kids don't have credit cards. Kids can't buy your products. So I wanted to test what would happen if I made a new account without one, doing any giveaways, two, adding any funny, dumb controversy, and three, without the super fast-paced editing because i realized older people like slower paced content so i took about two days to film and edit 30 tiktoks for the old account so i could just focus on the new account and on the new account i started posting really slow paced boring videos that were strictly about the product and this was the fourth video i posted my husband never cleans his glasses so i got a buzz buddy cleaner look at all the dirt that came out of it Remember to always clean your glasses. It's such a boring video, isn't it? But for some reason, it just blew up out of nowhere with like 300,000 views in a single day. And Jacob told me to add the link in bio call to action in the comments, but I hadn't reached 1,000 followers. So what I did was I just typed the website URL in the comments. And immediately after I did that, $300 in one day, $360 in one day, $400 in one day, $300 the next day, $300 the day after that, only one sale the next day and the next day, and $180 the next day over $2,000 in sales in one week. And Michael's private supplier charges me about $28 for one. So it was well over $1,000 profit in one week. It legit made no sense to me cause like, how is this even possible? Like how do you see a random video on TikTok from a random business you've never even heard of and you just spend $60 like that? Some people even bought two, $120. <laughs>
you Americans have too much money. Anyways, all the sales came from this one video. When I checked the analytics, it showed that most of the people watching were from 25 to 34 years old. So in other words, not kids. So I thought I had proven my theory right. But the thing is, nothing actually happened after that video. None of the other videos even passed 10,000 views. So I was wondering if it was just luck or something because we all know this video was very boring. Normally when one of my videos go viral, I know why it went viral but for this one i was just lost so at this point i had been uploading three tiktoks a day for the new accounts for the old accounts and i was also testing two other products that i will mention in a different video but the point is i was posting a lot of videos and nothing was working for over a week normally that wouldn't bother me but i had just come down from the hype of one thousand dollars in one week so like i was stressed out i was overthinking everything and i was thinking like so i can't even figure out how to go viral without any dumb controversy like the lgbtq discount thing that whole week i was just all over the place but i had another meeting with michael and jacob and for the second time jacob said something that really helped a lot he said i should try telling a story like the way i make my youtube videos a good story combined with a lot of movement in the videos helps a lot to keep people hooked and usually i treat tiktok as a completely different platform from youtube so i didn't try to make tiktoks the way i made my youtube videos but immediately i started doing that the first three videos got over 100 000 views and two of the videos went viral and the thing is i didn't even do anything crazy all i did was exaggerate like in this video all i said was my sister has worn her glasses for 50 decades 100 000 views just like that and this one got over 2.4 million views my husband ruined his nine thousand dollars glasses by rubbing it on his shirt a simple exaggeration and because i started the accounts with an older audience there was still a huge percentage of adults who watched the videos but the videos didn't bring any huge burst in sales at all even with call to action so i asked Michael and Jacob what they thought and this is what they said. The biggest thing is the audience. Um, I think it's probably gotten shifted towards a younger demographic but there's luck involved with it too. Like you can just get a higher converting audience because the videos are going to optimize. They're not optimizing on who's going to buy your product. It's optimizing on who's entertained by your video. I also asked the guys from the collective what they thought and this is what they said. Dude, Mikey, amazing storyline bro. When it comes to getting people to your website or actually making money off your TikToks, context is a big thing we talk about about your content felt not really like a business talking about like my husband did this no we want to say like, this is my business to give that little subtle context that you're selling a product i'm not the biggest fan of this product bro it's kind of a basic product honestly bro if i were in your position i would move to a better product it's a nice a really good video as well yeah it sounds like you're just not getting the traffic lack of traffic is either lack of call to action or lack of demand for the product it must just be a product that people aren't that interested in actually buying Honestly, I was hoping this was the video where I made $10,000, but life doesn't always work out the way you want. Right now, I'm currently running three products and two of them have started going viral. So hopefully the next video is a lot better than this one.